Hey folks, welcome back to the Smoky and Dress Variety Show. We're going to make a recipe out of our Smoky and Dress Low Carb Kitchen Recipes, which can be found on Amazon. Today's recipe is our scrumptious cheesecake. All right, so what we're going to do first is we have four blocks of cream cheese, which we have already softened in the microwave for about two minutes. That way that um, they eh, tend to mix easier especially when you add all the ingredients together. So we'll just slightly break them apart before we add the remainder. So next we're gonna add uh, two containers of whichever kind of yogurt you like. We use a light and fit Greek lemon meringue. So we're gonna put two containers of lemon meringue in here. There we go. We're also gonna add four eggs. We've beaten the eggs beforehand. Then we're going to add two tablespoons of lemon juice and two teaspoons of vanilla extract. And honestly, we didn't have lemon juice. So we added one tablespoon of lemon extract. We figured that should be strong enough to be equivalent to two uh, tablespoons of the lemon juice. From there, we're going to use our sweetener. We like to use just a generic um, sucralose or a generic Splenda. You can use anything, but it calls for a one cup of sweetener, but we're going to do a heaping cup. So here we go, heaping cup of Splenda. We'll go ahead and mix that together, and then we'll be on to our next step. All right, as you can see, we've uh, stirred it. Just give it a rough stir. Uh, stir it probably take us about maybe a minute or two. Now we're going to blend it with our electric mixer for about maybe 30 seconds to a minute, just to make sure our cream cheese has blended in with everything else. And we put it on high just to make sure. It blends easily and quicker. All right, so there we have it. For 30 seconds, we blended everything together with our electric mixer, and then we'll just scrape the sides of the bowl to make sure we have everything mixed in together. We'll bring this over to our uh, our grease cake pan. We grease our cake pan with a little bit of a cookie spray. We'll fill this up, and then we'll place it in the oven. All right, so that batch of our uh, low-carb cheesecake batter just filled up our uh, our cake pan just perfectly. So what we'll do is we're going to go ahead and preheat our oven to 325 degrees, and we're going to place this in our oven for about an hour or until the um, until the cheesecake solidifies. So when you shake it, if it doesn't move, then that means it is finished. And we'll also use a cute the uh, toothpick test just to make sure. All right, so here we go. We have this in for one hour, and we'll be right back. All right, we passed an hour. Let's open our oven slowly so it doesn't fall if it's not done. Let's see how it is. Okay, so it looks like it's browning. And let's try to a jiggle or move the um, pan slowly to see if it jiggles. Yeah, it kind of jiggles, so it means it's not finished yet. So we're going to close it back up gently. And let's see. We'll keep that. Let's lower it down to 300 degrees. If it's not done, you can lower it by um, 25 degree intervals, and then we'll put it on for another 15 minutes or so and just recheck later. That way it won't cook too much and won't burn before the middle is done. All right, so a half hour and 300 degrees was perfect enough. We just pulled it out of the um, oven, and if you look, you can tell that the sides are pulling away from the pan, indicating that it's finished. And when you... Um, Kind of pull it back and forth the rocket the middle doesn't really shake much so we are done and we're gonna let it cool here for about 30 minutes we'll put it into our fridge later um, after the 30 minutes and then by this evening it should be nice and solid where we can slice it and enjoy so of course let's go over to our book again oh we also made a cheesy low carb cr creamy cauliflower while that was cooking and that'll be a side dish for our, uh, our dinner this evening Anywho, again, Smoky and Giraffe's Low Carb Kitchen Recipes that can be found on Amazon. Happy eating, enjoy, and it's great to see you.